Hey howdy hey partners, today we're going to work on a display case for Woody. Let's get into it. You're watching Today I Grew Up. <laughs> he's for display only. You handle him too much, he's not going to last. Oh, hey, I didn't know you guys were here. Excuse my weird reenactments of the movie, I'm talking to myself. This display base that you see here, I usually put JC Alva Woody custom and my Ranger Customs Buzz custom here. And what I do is put the plastic on and then they usually stand in there. And this is usually removed. But I don't need this stand in here anymore because it doesn't just hold one Woody. So what I'm gonna do is unscrew this, take the stand part it just attaches off or it can slide back on but I'm gonna take this whole thing unscrew it so this is my old display case and I'm gonna reuse it again for this new woody since I didn't want to spend on an extra case because I already had the, done the work See, I ripped it off the original block because it was too tall but I added some felt pads here on the corners so it doesn't scrape surfaces because it's a wood coarse wood so I want it to protect whatever I put it on so it's gonna have the felt pads to protect it and there you can see that I drilled the screws through the old stand, through the plexiglass, it's basically like a plastic fake glass, and then through the wood panels, as you can see there. And so that's how I was able to secure it to the actual stand, um, which was awesome. So that worked out really nice. Uh, if you wanna see more information on this display case and how I put it together originally, click this card right here on the top right corner of your screen, and that'll take you to the video where I did that process. Here though, this is pretty much all the work has been done for me already because I had this already. So this is gonna work out really great. So what I'm gonna do now is add this part to the stand. As you can see, this part slides right in and I can adjust it for Woody and then I'm gonna place Woody inside of this little display case. I'll show you that. Here's Woody in the display case. It's a little snug. It barely fits in there, but honestly it fits. So I'm just grateful I have something. He could at least be in temporarily until I find something better just to keep him dust free out of the elements. And I like that he fits in there and the stand worked out because I didn't want anything to hold him by the neck just in case. So I really like the way this just kind of grips him under the arms there, just like the movie did. And so I don't have issues with Woody going forward and worrying about him getting dusty or dirty. Um, I definitely want to preserve this Woody as much as I can. But yeah, he fits in there pretty good. I'm just grateful. And also I can spend time just kind of posing him before I put the lid so that he's really uh, sealed in there. But I think he looks really good. It's really cool and especially because I didn't have another case for him. It's nice to have this one. So here we are partners, the movie accurate Woody and Buzz back in their display cases. As you can see, I removed the stand and so it's not in there anymore. So Buzz and Woody are a little bit more free to stand in there without anything in the way, which is actually better for me. And then in this one, we have the stand added. So the other movie accurate Woody, which I call Toy Story 2 Woody, is gonna be in that one. Eventually, maybe I might get a different kind of case but for now, these work for me as I want a smaller case anyways, because this is gonna fit on my uh, desk by the computer. Here's a side view of Woody and Buzz. So you can see there's a lot of room for Woody and Buzz in this. If you wanna see a review to the display cases, I have reviewed these before on my channel. You just gotta go to my playlist and check out uh, my Movie Accurate Mod, custom mod playlist, and I talk about the stands in more detail. So I do have reviews on that. I can also send you the link if you ask, and uh, you can watch the review video for this display case as well. Here's the top view of Woody and Buzz. They have a lot of room in there, I really like that. And then Woody has just enough room in this one. It is a little snug, but you know, I'm not complaining because it is enough room, I feel, for him. And so as long as it works and it's gonna keep him safe from the elements and dust, that's what's really most important for me. Well, partners, I hope you enjoyed the look at display cases updated and, of course, upgraded on the right. And it's nice to have display cases for these because they're rare and expensive and it took me a lot of time. And these are honestly, to me, in my eyes, priceless works of art, museum quality pieces. So I need to protect them behind plastic or glass is ideal so that they don't get dusty or ruined by weather, time and elements like the sun, things like that. 
As always, partners, thank you so much for watching, for liking and commenting. It really helps the YouTube algorithm. If you want to help support me to get to 100,000 subs this year, all you got to do is hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you're alerted for future videos on this channel, and I'll see you partners on the next video review. You want the real buzz like you? You're, a, uh, you're an accent figure. You are a sad, 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 strange little man. You are a sad, 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 strange little man. You are a child's plaything. Hey, Ham, look, I'm Picasso. I don't get it.